So, the dance warfare is about to come out. You guys gonna take your mom's wallet and go buy Advanced Warfare? Are you gonna camp in Advanced Warfare? Are you gonna play the co-op mode? The new co-op mode that was supposed to be super innovative, cool, and awesome. But that's not our topic for today. Today's talking. What happens when Call of Duty will? When Call of Duty is dead, it's nothing. It's just a game like the rest of the other games. In the background plays Sonic CD, a retro old game that died years ago. And I don't give a shit because it's fun. It's fun because... Let me compare this with the... Call of Duty is the same thing every year. Yeah, it is the same thing every year, but... When people say same thing every year, they mean the same, same, same shit all day, all the time. They don't know changes. No innovative things, like... Compare this game to other Sonic games. This game was different because it implemented warp speed time travel. But when you time travel to the future or the past, the level changes in design. Like for example, the present, it's uh, Eggman uh, put his machines in the past and they start to construct and they move to the present. Once you go to the future, everything is corrupted with machinery. If you go back to the past and destroy the machine that was building his robotics, you will save the future and you will see the the true good future beyond in the beyond. You will see machinery merging with nature in a beautiful way. That doesn't count as fucking sex. Nope, no sex. No sex in the background. Whatever. When Call of Duty dies, people are like Oh, hey, uh, remember when we used to play Call of Duty? Like, uh, yeah, yeah, uh, Black Ops 1 and Modern Warfare 3, yeah, they used to be fun. Yeah, Black Ops 1 was the shit back then, bro. Yeah, that's why everyone's gonna mention Call of Duty, like, the shit. Like, I asked my friend, like, hey, well, what'd you think of Crash Bandicoot? Like, yeah, that used to be the shit, bro. What'd you think of MW3? Yeah, shit, bro. Yeah, that's everyone would used to say. The old Call of Duty used to be the shit. The cool thing. The... the the innovative old. People like old games. I like old games. I don't like the new Sonic games. They don't seem very, very consecutive with their storylines or characters or voice acting. I like classics because it just brings you back to the childhood days. Call of Duty ain't about childhood. About competitive. So guys, what happens when Call of Duty dies? Let's start with the community. The community will die. Seriously, like die, die, die off. And it was a disease and we hated it badly. Or the community was a bunch of kids complaining about snipers. We all know that. The complaining, the bullshit, the shit happening around us will be gone. The community's dead. No one plays Call of Duty anymore, do they? Nope. No one does. Not anymore. Second, the MLG. ML fucking G. Well, stop. Call of Duty's dead. Who's going to play that thing again? Shooting a person in the head or the body. What's the difference? It's dead. Call of Duty's dead. They're like, oh, Call of Duty. Like, yeah, we don't accept that game no more. The game is old and sales went down and people stopped buying it. Now uh, Destiny and Halo are the new thing. And the Metal Gear Solid. Yeah. Yeah, I called it instead, bro. Yeah. One time it flopped was during Advanced Warfare's era. Yeah, Advanced Warfare sucked. Sledgehammer lives down badly. Next thing. Little whiny ass clans. The clans are like, oh god, Call of Duty's dead, what are we gonna do now? Clans that post Call of Duty videos daily and every day with their quad feed montages. I'm looking at you, FaZe. FaZe wannabes. FaZe kids. There's so many FaZe kids out there. So once Call of Duty got, dies, there will be no FaZe. Faze Clan will have to like, oh, uh, we quit. We don't like Call of Duty no more. Call of Duty is just not so cool anymore. 
we're sticking to a retro gaming. Everyone from the clan will depart and do their own shit again. Moving on. Optic will do the same thing. Optic will quit. Optic and FaZe will die because of Call of Duty's death. Well, if Call of Duty dies, there will be no FaZe or Optic. I'm not hating towards you wannabes who say, Optic and FaZe are good. Wah, 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 wah. Shut up. You're, you're, you're 12 years old. You're 11. You're, you're younger than I am. And you're debating with me that some gay ass clan in a game make you uh, worship them just to do what they want. Or else you want to be in that clan? You're pathetic. You don't have no life. You don't do no shit. You don't have a job. What annoys me the most about those. What annoys me the most of Call of Duty is dead. The kids. The kid community. Community of kids who. Wah, wah, wah. Call of Duty's the best. I like sniping. I like camping. I like to eat wings. You're a fucking retard. You're gay. Girls like a dick. I fucked your mom. Yeah, yeah, people. The kids that swear constantly. We'll go away. Once Call of Duty's dead, these kids will not show up. This game will be old as fuck. The only people who will be playing it are no mic people. Where, yeah, where? Well, kids screaming the mic. Squeaker on the phone. Squeaker everywhere. Squeaker trolling. Yeah, these guys made themselves an embarrassment in the in internet world. So you see, guys, kids will not show up in Call of Duty. This is dead. Like, we don't got no one thing to play. Way, way, way. Yeah, they're gonna cry. They wanna play Call of Duty, but there's no one with to play with. Call of Duty's dead. Call of Duty's no more. The kids are annoying and like they like to fap about it. They like to fap about Bay Phase and Optic all the time. Moving on though. YouTube. Ah uh, YouTube. The YouTube well YouTube and the C fucking O's. YouTube and the CEOs will like oh call these dead, we got nothing to do now. We can't make no game. That's based off Call of Duty. People are like, oh, it's Call of Duty all over again. Whatever. So you guys see. Nothing will happen. The SEALs won't care because they're going to try to do something similar to Call of Duty. They will not quit until they get that money they want so fucking badly. Fapping for it. YouTube. You guys know the three biggest YouTubers out there. T. Martin, Allie, Drifter. Drifter's not bad. He does speak about the Call of Duty, uh, what's good and what's bad about Ghost. He did say that. T. Martin and Allie are just fappers for Activision. They suck their dick for money. They, how, I don't know how much they pay them, but it's a lot. And we, well, they're money whores. They're salesmen with happy eyes and happy smiles just to make you happy. But I don't see no happiness in this com committed pathetic bullshit that happens constantly all the time. Getting game early. You play game early. Blah blah. Call of Duty release. Call of Duty speculation. Blah blah blah. Releasing trailer. Well guess what? Well Call of Duty dies. Yes. T Martin is gonna break up with his girlfriend. They're gonna fight and they're gonna break up with his short ass hottie girlfriend. Like it, his his girlfriend Haley. So moving on, then guess what? They're gonna break up with all the girlfriends. They're gonna have no life. Guess what? They're not gonna have nothing to pose. Nothing. Zip. Zero. Zero. You know what? Zero. None. Nothing. They're like, they're like, their channels will be shut down. They won't do anything, their subscribers will unsub, and life will be back to normal. And you see guys, that's why I hate these guys. T. Martin will break up with his girlfriend, we know that. Like his last girlfriend, Haley, where he posted like, oh he broke up with his girlfriend again. Girlfriend, what the fuck now? They get in a fight. Wait, wait, maybe. Wait, wait, hold on. Maybe they got in a fight like, 
She's like, you do YouTube more, you don't hang out with me more. And they act like it's... Uh, like, why do you show your family and friends on YouTube? Like, this is supposed to be you on random... And partnership, not you and friends and family. I'm looking at you, Woody's Gamer Tag. The true YouTubers out there, Thunder, JD, Mr. Soldier, Royal Patriot, Apocalypse, B Biblical Reaper, and t -Bets. These are the true YouTubers. Although COD will be dead to them, the true YouTubers, but they can do something else. They can play Destiny, they can play old games. Retro games, Halo, God of War, something different. Shadow, uh, Killzone, Crisis. Come on, who doesn't love Crisis? So anyway, guys, this is my topic of discussion about what happens when Call of Duty guys. So what do you guys think? Leave a comment below. Like, comment, subscribe. I guess. I'll see you guys fucking later. Bye.